So once again about Streeter. So the most interesting fact about Streeter is that is the literal sound of person suffocating. So Streeter is a high-pitched, harsh sound caused by turbulent, high-velocity airflow through a partially obstructed upper airway, the pharynx, larynx, or trachea. It's a, not a lung sound. It's the sound of air being uh, dispiritly forced through a dangerously narrowed, narrowed passage. The presence of Streeter, especially when heart uh, with heart at rest, so-called inspiratory streeter, uh, God forbid, means the airway is already critically narrowed. The next step is in this process. It's not gradual worsening. It's a completely airway obstruction and death. It's an auditory emergency siren. No siren. Unlike a subtle wheeze or crackle in the lungs, streeter is unmistakable. Loud alarm bell that screams, impending airway catastrophe, impending airway catastrophe, is one of the most frightening sounds in medicine. And actually the quiet is worse. While loud streeter is a terrifying, a patient with loud streeter is, uh, that is not becoming qu uh, quieter, where, where, while they are also becoming more fatigued and lethargic, it's even more terrifying. This doesn't mean they are getting better, it means they are tiring out, no longer able to generate enough airflow to even make the sound. The quietening of streeter is often a sign of impending respiratory arrest. So the cause dictates an action. So the sound itself doesn't tell you the cause, no. Only the, loca only the location and of course severity. The management depends entirely on the cause which creates a high stakes diagnostic rates against time. Is it infection? Well, for example, epiglottitis croup needs specific antibiotic steroids and airway support. Foreign body needs immediate removal. Ah, Heimlich, uh, bronchoscopy, anaphylaxis needs epinephrine immediately. A laryngeal edema after extubation needs steroids, racemic epinephrine. The sound is the what, but the doctor's job hour is to find why in minutes, even in seconds. Okay, stay blessed.